This is Darth Ravage 07 coming at you today with another Outback quick review on the porch. Uh, with all this nice weather, I thought I'd do some motorcycle bots. Uh, can't ride one, so might as well do reviews of them, right? Uh, so here is Transformers Animated Prowl. Got this guy in 2008. I got him locked down and uh, Starscream from Animated the same day. Thanks to my good friend Mikey. He hooked me up with the necessary fundage because I was a little bit short-handed and then I of course paid him back and uh, he is just that of a police uh, motorcycle from the show and that's the, that's the thing with these uh, animated figures they're very very beautiful to show accuracy and if you look right back out here you have just maybe a little touch of some visible hand syndrome I guess I swear I said it a little straighter. Uh, back in, it's got some dials there and some handlebars. These handlebars, I keep forgetting to fall back out when I come back into motorcycle mode. And uh, it's an easy thing to do. It doesn't hurt anything and it doesn't hinder transformation. It's just one of those things that's so tiny. And they've just got the details to it. So then you keep going around the block here. You can see that he's got one throwing star there and one throwing star there for his robot mode. He came with a traffic light that you could bash somebody in the head with but I don't ever really utilize that. And uh, I like how they, they got his little red and blue police uh, lights on the back end of it here. It's really great details that was in there. The original Autobot symbol was gold like the paint on there. So I put a Toy Hacks label on there, made it stand out and pop like the United version. Uh, so I'm gonna get this guy into his most excellent robot mode and finish off this really, really cool prowl review. Just bear with me a moment as we pause and here is Prowl from Transformers Animated in his robot mode. I really do love the how they managed to get it right off the cartoon screen into the toy form. With that said, there are some hindrances there. His uh, ankle tilts, he's got some to a degree, but it's more for transformation. Uh, he's got plenty of knee bend and craziness there. Uh, he has a waist articulation there and some swivels. And I even, you know, like to get more dynamic poses, did mods to the side of the legs. And then uh, there's where the handlebars are folded into the chest that I keep forgetting. Love how detailed the animated head is and what have you. We'll just take a quick spin around the block here and look at him. Uh, there's his little sirens on each arm he has that. These uh, front uh, covers from the motorcycle look like wings on his back. Kind of, you know, giving him that Autobot wings uh, look. You can see where I did the mod because that was all down into the knee. And now he's got pretty much free range there. The throwing stars, they do automorph when you do get them out. But I just think it makes the leg look empty. So I don't usually do that. As uh, he was more of a ninja, he did use the stars. But uh, he could kick butt all the same even without the stars. And a uh, lot of the detail of gold there on his forearm. And how they get actually put some uh dials on his instrumentation inside of his uh motorcycle cockpit there and so i can stand him up straight he just looks really boss and powerful he was teaching bumblebee in the show because bumblebee was just a rambunctious young and he's trying to teach him stillness and strike or st stillness and strike and how to to properly you know uh win in combat and uh this 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 mold is just a really good win for animated uh, figures. Uh, it was a really nice thing to have graduated from my school in, in 2008 to get my associate's degree to, to go home and watch this and celebrate a little bit more with my kids and the kids enjoyed this series. I did too. I had some fun. They did three seasons of it on Cartoon Network and and uh, they were getting to a really cool spot. With one big fella and i thought they were going to actually do a toy version of that but then the show got canceled they didn't do any more seasons after season three and uh i thought it was just getting its uh wind to be honest uh really love how that looks together there in his robot mode uh just really great it's a great figure to have if you haven't got him you uh, can pick him up still and he's also got another version where he's got a sidecar that adds samurai, ar samurai armor to him a bit later. And he is a master at the fist of met metallic metallic <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> uh, I went to go back and watch the series because it was just a really good series. But I really liked how zen this guy really was. He, he uh, was probably the most zen, proud in all the Transformers universe. And uh, was a joy to watch the confrontations between him and Lockdown because they both studied the same art. And uh, what a great show. I just uh, want to go back and dig those out of the stasis and watch all three seasons again. Whether the kid, Actually, I think I saw it on Tubi the other day. So I'll take a break from watching G.I. Joe seasons one and two and uh, Transformers G1 season one and two. Actually, I think I'm more of a season two fan in G1 than I was a season one. Season one was just, oh my gosh. Now that I'm older, I'm 45, I, I just don't know, man. But uh, animated is definitely for the young for the young ones and for the young at heart. And a lot of fun to watch. If you haven't caught it, catch it on Tubi. And uh, just visit my links down below in the description there. Please uh, smash that like button, comment below. Hit that uh, Patreon link there and visit it. Visit my Cruises, Inc. And hopefully one of these days when we get back out in the water, we'll be able to... Uh, get you some family memories just like you see on my Facebook there uh, cruising with your family and having a good time well that's gonna about do it for the Transformer Animated Prowl Quick Review uh, figures a lot of fun was one of the first three figures I bought with Animated and uh, handled the online prices but uh, Vian Landis guy he's a keeper for especially a motorcycle bot so till all are one have a great evening y'all be happy and safe out there thanks again for watching